This video will show you how to get started with Custom Translator, helping you to build your custom neural machine translation models using your own data to fit your style and terminology. Once deployed, your custom system can be used for both text and speech translation services. There are four steps to build and use these custom systems. One, upload. Two, train. Three, deploy. And four, use in production. Let's get started. First, go to customtranslator.ai and log into the Custom Translator portal. Next, select the training documents for your new model. Here's an example of training documents. English here and Japanese here. In this example, the sentences are not mapped. You can provide parallel data that is already aligned, but if you don't have that, for example, if your content comes from a brochure or a website, Custom Translator automatically matches sentences and aligns them for you. Next, select New Text Project. Input a project name, language pair for the system you're building, category, and project label. The label is important if you plan to build more than one system with unique category IDs for each project. Next, select the documents you uploaded in step one or upload additional ones that you want to include with this project's training dataset. Select Train, then input a model name and click Train Model. Training can take several hours depending on the amount of data uploaded. In your project view, navigate to the Models tab. If the training is complete, the Deploy button will be active. In the blue column, Custom Translator automatically shows the result of its blue score calculation. The blue score is an industry standard metric to measure the difference between the automatic translation and your reference translation. This calculation is based on randomly selected sentences extracted from the training set and not used for actual training. In this example, the green score, 38.83, indicates that the training of your custom model is better than the original one. Once you're ready, click Deploy and the system will be deployed to our production servers within a few minutes. Each training has a unique category ID. To use this model, use this ID in the category parameter of your calls to the Translator API. Now that the system has been deployed, let's use it. For this example, we're running simple Python code in a free Azure Jupyter Notebook. Input your category ID, the text you want to test, and the two language you want to translate to. Here we've chosen English. For the output, we're calling the translations twice. Once to translate content with no category ID using the generic models, and the second output to translate the content using the custom model with Custom Translator. Here we see the results. Using the generic model, the text in English says, in earlier versions of Excel, only the color of the lines that are included in the palette are supported. Not bad, but a bit wordy. With the custom translator model, the text in English says, in earlier versions of Excel, only the line color contained in the palette is supported. As you can see, it created a clearer, less wordy translation. Start building your own custom system and visit customtranslator.ai.